Welcome and hello everyone to a Friday night edition of Squad Ops Operations, One Life Operations. We got Operation Power Play Part 4. The Claw's still not happy with uh, the militia's performance, so we're going to be going at it again. Still trying to root out the Canadians, and the Canadians are still trying to root out the militia forces. Tonight we're going to be on Manic 5. We'll be getting the Canadian Armed Forces against Militia Forces. Those Canadian forces, uh, they're going to have a cop tonight that they're going to need to defend while sending out patrols to root out the militia hunters. Uh, let me post that op doc for you so you can follow along on what we're talking about. So the missions for tonight, uh, Canadian forces are going to be starting at the cop, which is located at India 786. And the Canadian Forces Platoon must conduct one of the task missions. Militia forces are going to be starting in various locations. Militia forces mission is unknown, but they will serve the claw. Serve the claw. We don't have an op map, but uh, commands for tonight starting out on round one. We got Dix Hulk in command. Two IC is going to be Alpha Guido leading out the rest of the SLs. Matt Honcho, Adikin, and Bus Driver. Over on the militia side, we got Lawn in command. It's two IC is going to be Astreos. Correct me on that one. Lean out the rest of the SLs. It's going to be Utopian J, Frost, and Violence. Love this guy. Just straight up violence all the time. And then loadout. Starting out with the Canadians. We got one SL, two FTLs who are going to be riflemen, two ARs, two LATs, and two medics across the platoon. They'll spread out two hats, two MG. And they will not be needing crewmen. That must be a copy and paste from three. Vehicles will be getting one trans truck and two Logi trucks with 500 ammo and 1,000 build each. Fob and logistics. They'll be getting one fob, one mortar, and various defensive structures. No command support call-ins. And oh, oh, wrong button. Oh God. Oh, what are we doing? Okay, now it's working. Uh. Militia, they'll be getting one SL, two FTLs. They're going to be riflemen also, and one medic. And then their platoon loadout is unavailable. And then vehicle-wise, they'll be getting one trans techie. No fob and logistics. Command support call-ins are unavailable. Oh, excuse me. I'm a little gassy tonight. A little gassy. But, uh, yeah, like I was saying... We're here on Manic. We're overlooking the cop that they're going to be doing. It's kind of like in the center of the map, sort of. It is uh, India 786. Militia objectives. Oh, actually, let's go to the Canadian objectives first. So we can get and go through all this cool stuff. Uh, primary mission is to defend the firebase FOB radio at India 786. Secondary, conduct sweep and clear patrols of the following locations for milit militia activity and equipment. All buildings in India 5, upper hydro facility tanks in Gulf 6-3, the logging site and all buildings in G84, G85, and G87, the old workshops in G417, Mount Jolie, Town Center, all buildings in Kilo 7, Ki Juliet 7, Kilo 8, and Juliet 8, with militia militia. Equipment or supplies are found. Destroy them at location of discovery and inform company command. Intel. The initial reports were militia hunters, but interrogation and examination of these militants show they are not local by any means. Due to the rampant looting, reinforced outposts have been built to help conduct security patrols of the vital areas. All citizens have been evacuated, but you may encounter hostage residents. Okay. Yep. Uh, before live, they're going to be spawn spawn at main, move to the firebase, which they're there, and they cannot build before live. They have to start inside the firebase walls, so they have to start within this little trapezoidal fob cop. Uh, all squad leaders, we are on a vanilla layer. We we still are working on the mod, getting ready for the new update that just released, which we will talk about in a little bit. Uh, for the platoon army, platoon mater may switch out of available in the army AR for MG, lat for hat, and up to a limit in the armor account and additional crewmen for any squad. Uh, calf may not place a AP or AT mines. Uh, standard rifleman rolls should drop ammo bags at main. 
or their start location. Only FTL can have the ammo bags. CAF may not resupply except from FTL ammo bags. Vehicle stealing is on. And then militia objectives. The Canadian forces have built a cop at the top of the mount, the top of the hill of West Mount Jolie is impacting your ability to scrounge and move about. Your cell is ordered to attack it and destroy it. Your weapons group and ammo are limited. However, prior to our local attacker call, concealed weapons around a cache. Uh, hidden weapon cache is one or more buildings in I-5, somewhere near the upper hydro facility tanks in g 3 These are the caches that they can find. One of the lodging site buildings in GA-4, all those places that we listed earlier, they can pick up extra weapons, extra kits. Uh, the supporters of our mission are trying to get us needed equipment to finish our attack. Canadian Armed Forces are here and are getting strength and control in the valley. The call wants more direct attacks on the Canadians to keep them busy and allow our main mission to move forward. They'll hold spawn. Uh, they will choose four of the six starting locations and move to those locations. Using one lodge truck and then place a rally and spawn their squad. Starting locations are Delta 5-1, Fox 9-1, Hotel 9-1, Juliet 10-1, Lima 10-3, and November 6-1. They have to start within the grid of that referenced starting location. Uh, they can't drive the use the Logi truck after live. Uh, for the hidden weapon caches, event admin will place random fobs in locations outlined in the objective section of of above. Once mills within 33 meters of the fob, event admin will spawn one Logi techie nearby the location. Mill may may then place and build an ammo crate by transferring the ammo and build, and then rearm or change kits. Uh, additional per squad, they will be able to get an additional two AR, two lats, one sapper, and one medic. No uh, They cannot place AP or AT mines. They may place IEDs after live. No IED drones. Got to check their weapons for scopes. They can only use red dot sights or iron sights, and they can only resupply off of FTL ammo bags in the hidden weapons cache. Vehicle stealing is on. I guess this is for me. The claw may only speak about him or herself in the third person. I don't know who's going to be the claw, but okay. But yeah, we got a we got an update uh, here in squad recently. We got the Aussie faction, the Australians. Looked at it earlier today. It's really good. Hopefully, you've had the chance to play it. Uh, I haven't had a chance yet. Uh, I was going to use tomorrow, but I got to go do some family stuff. But I did take a chance to look at the new camo netting, and it is ridiculously awesome. Um, being able to, you know, see inside of it, like see out of it, but not being able to see into it is definitely going to be a meta changer, I really think. But at the same time, like people are going to use it for good, but at the same time, people are going to focus on those more. Uh, the tire fires are ridiculous. Like the smoke of it is the smoke column is so high. It is, it is ridiculous. Like it is nuts how high. I mean, you can probably see that on some maps. I would say on here, if you lit a tire fire over in those hills, you would see the smokestack probably like up to, you know, these clouds right here. Like It is ridiculously high. Um, the fire is not that bad. Uh, I know it causes uh, burn damage to vehicles, so you can't just drive over it. And be like, ah, look at that! I'm gonna, I'm just gonna drive it. It will, it will destroy part of your vehicle. It'll definitely kill a person. Yes, Picar, stream the hell out of it. I wanted to do like a a stream of it yesterday. I say it was Thursday, right? Yeah, but I didn't get I didn't get home from work until almost eleven. I was like, yeah, no one's gonna watch a stream starting at eleven o'clock p.m. Not a.m. But I'll tell you one thing: when the Marines come out, Wilbur's taking the day off, and we're gonna do a long stream. We're gonna do like a like an entire day of just playing as the Marines. Oh, we'll have a server popped. It just depends on if the server is up. Uh, we've been having some issues with some external entities 
we believe uh the denying is, uh, our service uh, positions that shit needs to get placed at but for some fucking reason uh when they're in admin cam or when, when the ea is in admin cam and he tries to place a radio it says no because there's not a direct line of sight so he has to drive to each individual location for all of their individual weapons Everyone caches and they're pretty far spread out five years oh shit they finally oh, they decided to mess with our shit God. Oh, I can't dive off this because there's fall damage in here. Yeah, that's right. There is no uh, playing operation. We're doing it now instead of tomorrow night, which is actually pretty good because we've got a last-minute family thing to take care of. And, of course, Easter Sunday, for those of you that uh, practice Easter, um, we'll be doing, uh, we won't be doing anything, but definitely doing some more family things this Sunday. Hopefully you're having a good week. Hopefully your weekend's starting out right. I know it is because you're here with us watching an operation, especially on Manic. This is definitely one of my favorite maps. I just love the terrain. I love the, the way it looks. I love the way it plays. The only thing I wish is that on Invasion that they opened up both sides of the river. Uh, V1 is all on this side and V2 is all on this side. I wish V1 and V2, they kind of just crisscross this river all working your way all the way up the dam. Like both of them start down here and you have to work your way up this way or you have to work your way up that way. It's a big map. You can do it. OWI, stop being lazy. Yes, sir. No, I can't call him lazy. We did uh, a couple days ago find an Easter egg within squad. Uh, if you check out our discord there are hints to the easter egg and it involves a modern techie and flight we will just say that command recommend we at least do a platoon brief but uh this might take a little bit we'll just build after live or something we'll probably have time all right all right then uh get over here platoon brief Tonight we got Power Play Part 4. I'll post that op doc for you so you can catch up. Also, uh, don't forget to uh, volunteer for command. Go ahead and check that out. Oh, and don't forget about, uh, we do have Squad Ops merchandise now over on Teespring. Actually, I should probably post that. It's probably gonna, it's on an automatic thing, but I, I, I'll post it here again. Oh, jeez. Character limit. I just copied and pasted uh, a paragraph like three times. You're going to have to give me a second. This, uh, let's, let's just do this. Let's do it the easy way. Uh, that's not the one for merch. Ah, there we go. Yeah, it is the merch command. Woo. <laughs> I thought I hit the wrong one. Uh, I think we're going to go into... A little light up, but I think we're going to go into a platoon brief here in a couple of seconds. Oh, good. Yes. A little bit of heavy cream, a little bit of honey. Mm. I don't know what those people were jumping off the top of that building for or why he's up there, but definitely. A... Uh, we're on one, so uh, we're going to basically, there is an individual known as D Claw. So I know that he's acting the opposite to us and he wants it kill all of us and chop our heads off and we have reports that he has weapon caches in these areas so we're going to split up and find these weapon caches we're holding a solid defensive position around this uh, bob area here we're gonna have bus drivers going directly to our north checking for weapon caches we're going to have adigan going to our southwest to um to the more urban areas checking for weapon caches we're gonna have guido going to the southwest to the logging facility checking for weapon caches then we're going to have Matt on point defense, making sure we don't slip past our lines. Any questions? Okay, guys, I'm all right. Break the mark. Get ready for live. Yes, sir. And there we go. All right. A tomb brief from Dick's Folk. But yeah, I don't know why they were jumping up and down off of that stuff. It's just a, just a bunch of clowns. Remember, guys, you have to start within the walls of the, uh, of the fob. We can't leave. 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 We can't leave
How short is it? Like, uh, 30 on 30? Well, like 30. Yeah. No. One off of one side, so... Yeah, 30 on 30. There we go. We're good. Zeppelin. I mean, I'm fine with the small squad. It'll be fine. You need to start within the wall. I think they opened it up to uh, people without basic. Hey, uh, clear a little, please, guys. Yeah, we always got one clown. Oh, well, might be a quick hop tonight. Going live here shortly, so just get ready. Only what thirty? Like I said, thirty on thirty. Might be a quick op. Might be a long op. I mean, sometimes when we have lower player counts, it kind of goes slower. Or it could go really fast. It could just be an immediate bloodbath. It's just how it is. We see Frost down there with his squad. Five is EA setting up the fobs. He's got to go to each individual fob and set it up. I got a guy that just switched squads. And, uh, he, he has to switch kits and it's going to take a while. What do I exit right here? Yeah, I'm going to have a few power parks strategically. I got a little bit. Just, he has to what, respawn at main and then respawn back here. Yeah, he's got to spawn at main, but it's like, what, a two minute respawn timer for uh, suicide? I have no idea. Is it going to be any way to speed up the uh, mill uh, construction for round two, or we just have to set the grid again? For round two, yeah, because round two, it's going to be, I'm going to help along with the EA, so we'll, we're going to double up. It took a while this time as well, just because we were not, we were not ready for it. Dude, you're a bad boy. Sure. Where's the cheese man? Cheese man. Barton's not here. Barton's the only cheese man inside squad ops. Right now he's trying to fix all the servers so that we can get people to play on them. Yeah, I'm excited to play as the Australian faction. I just like the the AUG uh, weapons that they have. Yeah, not, not much, you're good. Nice, finally. Holy shit, I'm being so quiet. Whoa, what the, what the Why am I so fast? No, no. Just don't walk too much. We have to turn it on to speed this up. Just, just sit still. Yeah, make sure you don't go outside of the my name's hey, Barry Allen. Fast, the fucking leaves are moving now. What the fuck? Holy shit! Oh, Holy shit. shit. <laughs> one one. Hey, hey, dude, dude my, I don't know if my What's Chromebook can uh, run this. Come on, guys. Oh. <laughs> Short moves. Short moves, or Short moves. Short moves. Short moves. Short moves. Short moves. Oh, there, it's back. Slow mo. That's just like barely touching. It's like tick tick tick. That was insane. That was funny. No. That's how you get across the map in two seconds. <laughs> do, do you you to... Turn that bad boy up to like 50. Yeah. Woo wee! Okay, like having nitrous. Alright, boys, start stacking. Battle buddy? There he is. Yes. Just uh, help with me real quick, Tasha. After we can build, uh, just build this mortar. 
No, that's good. Cool. Uh, Alright, we're letting guys. We're good. We are live with round one, Operation Power Play Part 4. You're a mad squad who shovels out. Oh, I just had a... Something stuck in my throat. I had a cough. God, I got that out without sounding like I was dying. What is that? That is just a... Kid, this is just a mess. Ugh. Disgusting. Not seeing any militia forces here. I just see frost forces. Uh, T4 come. Ooh. Or might meet up with them. Before there. Let's find these people. Yeah, I'm, uh, I, I'm glad that it is getting more popular. Um, definitely need to do our best as some of the squad veterans to rope in these new people kind of give them a guiding hand on how squad should be played like most of the militias down to the south the cannabis farm except for one squad coming from their main I don't know where they went We're here. Oh, they're coming across the bridge. Hey, down there. I don't think they're going to get here. I think Canadian forces are going to be able to set up. Nice little foothold. Ooh, looks like three and crossed. Possibly could run into each other. Crosses. Fighting the high ground on this one. A lot of a lot of people say that squad is an old game and hasn't had that many updates and da, 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 but it's still an awesome game the way that it plays negative it's definitely going to have the longevity just like arma does it's going to have a influx of new players people coming back to see stuff especially when they have new factions or they release new content of course people are going to come out people just want new content all the time new content new content and you can only add so much to the game before it just doesn't work anymore. As long as they don't add in weapon skins, I'm all for it. Contact Northeast. Let's get eyes on this hill now. Northeast of U1. Uh, Mike 736. Mike 736. Far Eastern Bridge, one fire team spotted. Someone's got some good eyes. They're up there. Pretty distant contact. Worry about. Contact is cross bridge, they're south, Mike 895. One full squad. Yeah, Alright, I'm just good, yeah. They're, they're gonna be heading the way once I get get ready for that. They gotta see him walking around in that town. Yeah, I see them. I see them. They're running around like headless chickens. Confirm contact down here by me. Yeah. 
what they needed and they're yeah, taking off. So many markers on here, I can't even see where I am. Like threes made their way pretty fast. Three and four. You're gonna try to get to one of these caches, arm up. Okay, go in and just start deleting this stuff. Can I delete some of this? Yeah, I can. I should go through and just delete all of this stuff. This is ridiculous. It's a mess. But I'm not gonna do that. We're gonna we're gonna watch. See the eye in the sky. Wish I had like a little drone sound with my camera. People always know where I am. Uh, command, this is like, one, we got one squad moving east, Lima 852 heading our way. You know, we look to be moving into the buzzing now, here. Pulling my guys back to the hill. And I'm just saying, yep. Yeah. It goes away from fobs blowing up. Uh, this is uh, squad two to command. Are we to dig down enemy radios we find as well? Did you say you uh, found a down enemy radio? An enemy radio. I was not sure if you we were only dig down crates or the radios too. Uh, you dig down the radios as well. Alright, thank you. There's one potentially in second squad spotted east southeast, unsure at this time. Alright, copy. Yeah, if you get overwhelmed by two squads attacking you, uh, yeah, start to pull back. Command, be advised, we're breaking contact. We had guys engaging us from Hotel 844. We're moving north to sweep Gulf 63. See if we can find the cache there. I understood, yep. Uh, if you find that cache or engage enemies, uh, push east and then uh, cover eastern flank from there. On. Yeah, most of this is just you vanilla caches in India 5 yet? bobs being set up uh, firm, we're down the circles are right now. going can't delete those uh enemy radio is down Copy to acknowledge. Moving along the riverbed. That is ballsy for lawn darts. Dan, there's also another weapons cache. Um, it's pretty far out there, but be advised there could be contacts coming from that direction as well. Uh, good copy. It is Gulf 3 in that area. Yeah, hey, there you go, Blaze. Yeah, it's right there. Yeah, with smaller ops, it's it it is hard to have a lot of engagement, especially on a map this size. They're gonna play ring around the rosy. That's why it's good that there is a central location. I'm pretty sure militia's just trying to arm up, get their extra kits. And then they're going to get into some type of formation and start attacking the cop. Once the cop attack happens, I mean, this is a beautiful location to attack and defend. Got some shrubs, trees, you know, on the north side. You have a hill on the south side. Very well fortified with natural fortifications. Plus, 
you know, the, all the Hesco barriers. I think it's going to be an interesting a attack. It's going to be a hard attack. Easy, probably easier to defend. Command, we got another. Uh, See razor wires going up. Immediate contact. We're going to continue our sweep north towards Gulf Four One. See if we can find one there. Yeah, understood. Uh, there's also another location at Gulf Gulf Three on top of the dam. So if you guys be contact on top of the dam, that will have a, a be shooting down. Yeah, a lot of people put razor wire right along this. I'd put the razor wire out here. Out on the high ground. Stop them. Direct them into this kill field right here. One, have you hit any contact over there? Uh, yeah, this is admin cam. Uh, the objectives, militia and red need to get to these radios and uh, southwest. try to gain some more kits. They're only starting out with three different kits. They want more. And then the Canadians are trying to find these radios, dig them down, deny them being able to get extra kits, and then finally defend this cop location here. That's the basic gist of it. But it's Militia versus Canada on Manic 5. Alpha's going for another radio. I think everyone's in position for militia, getting ready for their assault. Do have a mortar up somewhere up right. Up oh, there's a mortar right there with Matt Anjo. Just let me know any grid you want mortared, and I'll send it that way. Command, once we uh, get this last cache up here, where do you want us sweeping towards? You want us just heading back towards the FOB, set up the defensive perimeter? Oh, uh, yeah, head, head, head back towards the FOB and guard our east southeast side. Copy that. Oh, no, sorry. Oh, southwest. Southwest, copy. Yeah, I think militia is just getting it, trying to get into position to attack this cop location. There's frost. Alpha might get cut off. Command, this is one. Confirm they have kids to our southeast. At least one AR spotted. Understood. No one wants to attack right here, so they're probably going to try to attack this sector and this sector right here. The alpha getting cut off might work in their advantage and cut back on uh, Astrios. Got a long way to climb up these hills, though. He's probably worried because he probably saw that that radio went down. So he's probably thinking there's people up in that, one the fuel tanks. My move marker, they're in Juliet 761. Uh, one can you repeat? Contact within 200 meters on Juliet Everyone 761. And get spoiled by these one life events. Don't worry, you're not the only one. It makes it hard to go back to, van to vanilla ops. But 
my best advice to you is take what you learn in the operations and apply it to vanilla help me stay alive a lot longer in vanilla than normal my biggest thing is patience i have no patience and it gets me killed all the time in video games so whenever i'm about to do something i'm always like patience 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 how beautiful that looks not the gun but yes the gun but like this the micro terrain on this map like just that is awesome like the, someone had to take time and think about how they wanted this micro terrain to come out and of course the sound design and squad as i always say is just better than anything Nothing is on par with it. Command update. We've dug down another cache up here. We're going to be heading, falling back towards the fob now. We're about maybe a kilometer out. Understood, yeah. Yeah, just find some uh, position in Hotel 7 and GPS 7 looking southwest. Hey, firm. Wait, Hotel 7, that's a bit further downhill. Oh yeah, um, Hotel 6, yeah, just, yeah, just, um, doing like the ring we got going here along this high ground. Copy. Terrain might not be good out there, I'll let you know if, uh, any of the spots are hold, able to hold or if I need to shift. Yeah, yeah, just let me know. Two's moving slowly up there. Oh, what was that? I'm gonna move away. Command, this is what we're taking rocket fire from the south southeast. Acknowledge. Oh, that's from Charlie Foxtrot. Contact is Julie 868 and spread out. Is going out. Julia eight nine one mortars. Copy. Just put like one or two there. The three landing are gonna land south of that. Copy. That's right where the uh, lap fire from. We're going out. Contact is disengaged southeast, unsure where they're at at this time. Copy. Have we taken any casualties yet? One's up. No shit. Right. You can still play vanilla, it's not unplayable. Not yet. Need to direct people, you know, how the game should play. Just give suggestions. 
get upset about a video game. It's just a video game. Enjoy it. That kind of just oh big guy. Hands down. Alpha was made to able to get back. No, we're taking lat fire from the west on the half. I think they're gonna run in to two. It's gonna be three and two. To assist uh, one if necessary. Did he see you, Bartok? Did he see you? They they are running. Uh, they are running two east. For now. Command, be yep, advised. Contact suggestion. coming in from the west. Repeat, contact coming in from the west of the fob. Four, watch west or whoever's on the fob. A copy. Uh, are they direct to south of you three, or are they to your like? We south we place? caught we caught some of them to our south. Yes. Unknown at range. Okay. Here, Gooby, right here. Gooby, get set up here. Looking 150. They've got to cross this open this open terrain here. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what they were shooting at, but okay. There's one, we're taking two losses. Okay, understood. Uh, two, move uh, south and support one for now. Hey, for Command, we are waiting for these contacts right now. Last seen are there in Hotel 622, trying to move east. We're setting up to kind of let them come to us so we can catch them in a crossfire or catch them in the flank when they run. Okay, understood. Yeah, we can't see down the wheel like going directly right west from outside the uh, fob, so we wouldn't be able to fly crossfire onto that They're road and we're waiting to catch them there. Basically. Oh, Bartok, they're directly south of you. Stay hidden, right? Hug if you can. Just peek them. Oh, is Frost like right up on top of them? Oh, yeah, Frost and Bob Ross are right on top of them. Oh, they know now. All right, contact on the fire. I oh, got one. On the west wall. Maybe two. Contact on the wall west. Yep. Oh, Wild Talk tried. Alright, did they up explosions? One, I will time it back here. There's one smoke from the grenades. Like the visual effects of them, or am I just losing it? And just never notice how awesome they are. Well, how more awesome they are. Oh, 
Ooh, I just got tagged. How close is contact on the point? Locked out on that one. Yeah, three view. Close it from the north. Try to catch any stragglers that are trying to sneak around the north walls or whatever. Just get within a sight of the uh, bomb. Poor Zuba. Directly into the property, he wants to play ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Copy. Or should I say, poor lawn darts. Wow. You know, I'm going to have to say, Matt Honcho on mortars is extremely OP. Like, he, I think he's the Bartok of mortars. I got three more mortar volleys. That'd save my mortars. I that oh, nice. Uh, squad two is here. You should work together and uh, suppress and bound across the road together. Hey, friend. Ooh, good shot, Bartok. 204, copy. Command, we're sweeping south uh, from the west side, and we're going to wrap around the south side. Uh, yeah, uh, the south side is not clear. Just be advised if you 
Oh no, Bob. <laughs> oh god, Bob. <laughs> oh no. Dodgy mortars and fire. Last little element here with Joe Violence. Squad one and squad two is taking contact east net this time as well. Man, this is when we get contact direct east. Fifty meters on the wood logs. Uh, it could. It could be uh that you have a, a throttle on your CPU. Like, best thing to do is go into the squad ops uh Discord and. Type something in in tech, the tech channel. I give you more information there. Can't diagnose your issue without knowing your whole system specs. I have a 2080 Ti and I'm sitting at 60 right now and I'm playing in uh, 2K. So, yeah. Type something up in tech for general help or squad chat. Oh, I didn't see these guys down there. Uh, squad two is taking heavy contact east. People, uh, low pass, low pass in front. Northeast, northeast. What? Oh. Escort 2 is taking heavy casualties at this time. Heavy contact east, southeast. I understood. Uh, maybe you guys can get like an L formation going in Pinsir. Paper. I'm gonna be brave. They're pushing in close in front of these guys. Those mortars were just too damn good. I just Dude, they were. Straight up. <laughs> Dude, they were perfectly <laughs> outside the wall. I was like, alright, hopefully it's not too close. So, I hit a. Grenade? Nice, nade! Contact from now. Right, okay. Sweat so taking heavy contact north, northeast, and uh, mainly. Oh my god. That is crazy. I need like I just got a triple kill. I think it was Bartok. He's down to it. Charlie Fox and Fluffs. Fluffs is going to get deleted. Footsteps south of the, the fob is what my guy's saying. Oh, so contact south of the fob. Bam, butters. My guy said he heard some footsteps, but he might have been mistaken. My guy's called out contacts approaching the uh, fob from the north, northeast. Northeast? They are within 50 north right, of the fucking fob. Uh, 
Alpha, just uh, maintain your positions and uh, we'll try to get across from them. Do you have like an elevated position on them? Uh, we're wrapping around them right now. Okay, yeah, we can flank them, that'd be great. Now it's just fluff some Charlie Foxtrot. Yeah, contact on the radio tower. Oh, now it's just fluffs. He's under the radio tower behind one of the, the legs. Yep. Don't see much. Just toss a nade in there. I saw a bunch of dudes just this way. And there it is. That's going to do it for round one of Operation Power Play Part 4. Going to take a quick break. And when we come back, we will have part round two. Not part two. Round two of part four. Good Lord. Quad Ops is a community focused on immersive and tactical gameplay. Realistic event scenarios create a cinematic experience for players and spectators. Quad Ops is geared towards those who want to experience the rush and thrill of combat within planned operations with defined mission objectives and dynamic engagements. If you're looking for hardcore, tactical, and cinematic gameplay, Squad Ops is perfect for you. Our missions and operations are usually streamed live on Twitch and archived to our YouTube channel. To participate in our squad or armor events, head over to our website and Discord for details of how to join in the fun.
ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Going to be getting ready for round two, Operation Power Play Part Four. Had to make sure I was saying the right thing on the right syllable. Yeah, I am Wilbur. I will be your host tonight. We've got the Canadian Forces versus the Militia Forces here on Manic Five. So the mission for tonight, Canadian forces are going to be starting at their cop. Uh, and then they need to set up defenses around that cop and take out different uh, weapon caches throughout the Manic 5 locations that the militia forces have set up. Uh, the militia forces are going to be starting in various locations and they will have to do nothing but just serve the claw. Serve the claw. Serve the claw. Commands for round two, switching things up. We got uh, Lawn Darts in command for the Canadian Forces. 2IC is going to be Astros. Uh, Lady Not the is going to be Utopian Frost and Violence. Over on the Militia side, we have Dix Folk in command. 2IC is going to be Alpha. Press the SLs, Matt Hancho, Itakin, and Bus Driver. And then loadout starting out with the Canadians. They're going to be getting one SL, two Rifleman FTLs. Two ARs, two lats, and two medics. Cross the platoon spread out. Two hats, two MGs, no crewmen. Uh, vehicle wise, we'll get two trans trucks and two Logi trucks with 500 ammo and 1,000 build. Bob and Logistics will be getting one fob, one mortar, and various defensive structures. No command support call ins. And then for the militia side, they'll be starting out with one SL, two FDL riflemen, one medic, and then depending on caches that they get they will get extra kits and then vehicles will be getting one trans trucky only used for setup no fob call-ins no command supports nothing other than trying to find these caches and getting the information and weapons from those caches this is the cop that the canadian forces are going to be in charge of defending and post that op doc again so you can follow along catch up do whatever you want. Read it, live it, love it. Uh, Canadian objectives. Their primary objective is to defend the fire base in India 786, which we're looking at now. And then they need to conduct a sweep and patrol of all buildings in India 5. All these here. Upper hydro facility tanks in Gulf 63, which is these right here and then the lodging site and all buildings in g84 g85 and g86 or g8 no g87 everything down in here then old workshops in g417 which is what g417 that's like e4 g4 Oh, I guess it's like over in here. Yeah, right, right here. These guys. And then Mount Jolie Town Center and all buildings in Kilo 7, Juliet 7, Kilo 8, and Juliet 8, which are all over in here. Uh, and if they get any of those, find any of those equipment, they need to destroy them. Basically, dig down the radio. Uh, calf will start at main and moves to platoon to the fire base. They may build before live. All ammo must be unloaded onto the fob. Calf has to start inside the firebase walls. We are on vanilla, so they need to do a weapons check and make sure no one's running around with optics. Get iron sights or the uh, red dot sight. FTL is the only ones with ammo bags. So everyone else has to drop their ammo bags, and they can only resupply from those ammo bags. Vehicle stealing is on. And then all of those locations that I was talking about earlier is where hidden weapon caches have been set up from militia forces. And once they get there, they'll get extra kits. Uh, those kits will be... Where are they? Where is it? They can get an additional two ARs, two let. This is per squad. Two ARs, two lats, one sapper, and one medic. Uh, and they can choose four of the six... Possible starting locations. Uh, Delta 5 1 is Delta. Where am I at? Delta 5 1. Hey, sorry, I'm, oh, I'm 
all the way in the wrong spot. Delta, 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 five, one, down here. Uh, d -d 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 -d. Hotel nine, one, Julia, 10, one, Lima, 10, three, and November six, one. Once they are inside the 30, 33 millimeters, uh, 33 meters of a fob, event admin will spawn one Logitech nearby the location. They can get their kits off of that. Uh, vanilla play again. They got to make sure they don't have any optics. They may not place AP or AT mines. They may place IEDs after live. Only one IED per sapper. No IED drones. Uh, riflemen have to drop their ammo bag so all they can supply off of is FTL uh, uh, ammo bags. Vehicle stealing is on. And yeah, that is... That's, that's everything. So... Yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed the last round. Canada was able to get their mission done. Uh... So we'll see how this one plays out. Got lawn darts in command of the Canadians now. Why did that not post? Why did OpDoc not work? Did I spell something wrong? Okay, now I posted. I don't know why I didn't post earlier. That's weird. Yeah, oh, well, they're putting their mortar in the same spot. I guess that, that's a pretty good spot for the mortar. A lot of cover from uh, direct fire weapons. And they don't have... Wait. Where do we see this? Where is this? Where is this? You can't see if was behind it or not. Where are the murder holes? Where is this? Where is this? Oh, here it is. Yep. This is the camo netting I was talking about earlier. They can kind of see through it, but from this way, you can't see anything. See that? Here. It's opaque ish. You can fire through it. You can see through it. But on this side, nothing. You can't, you can't, you can't. I mean, you can, you can kind of see, but not very well. Not from a distance. You got to get close up on it. Um, yeah, just do squad briefs. We're patrolling, right? Ah, that's a that's weird that it posted for you all, but didn't post for me. Yeah, the murder holes. That's that is awesome. That you can't see, really can't see. Th I mean, this is the distance. I mean, from here it just looks like a closed off window. Yeah, you really can't see through it. You got to get way up in there, Morty. Like way up in there. I like it. Don't change that OWI. Keep it that way. That's one of the changes that they made in uh, 2.15. <laughs> well, you know, I'm hoping, hopefully that you're, you're just watching it, you know, laying in bed, relaxing, you know, about to go to sleep. I hope this isn't causing you to go to sleep. I hope this is kind of one of those things where, oh, I can't sleep now. Over with. I doubt it. He's done. All right, Squirrelly. Make sure we haven't blocked any of the entrances with barbed wire or anything. Okay. Right. Uh, close. And yeah, head over for platoon brief. Oh, where's Long? Where is he? Into a platoon brief. Platoon brief. Where is Long? Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Where the hell did he go? What are you doing here? Go over there. Should I, not, I should not be here? Yeah, we just want to do a platoon brief. You sure come here, please. All squads, please come to me for platoon brief. The hell is he? Taking down this place. Oh, he's inside. <laughs> I'm looking outside. Thank you. Uh, and he would be in here doing it. I like this tent. 
I can stay here forever. It's kind of cozy, you know, kind of warm. Come on, guys, come on in. It never affected. Can I get a yeah. shovel over here? here? We need a proper... Uh, I, I like that it's around, around it right? reminds me of the igloos back home. All right, yep. There, there's your platform. There you go, Lon. Lon. All right, oh, perfect, thank you. Oh. Yeah, okay. much better. Ooh. All right, so welcome, guys. Uh, first round's obviously tough, but uh, this round we get to have all the OP stuff, uh, like this firebase. This is what we're protecting. Uh, the media has been calling it uh, an invasion, but uh, our mission is our own. Our destiny belongs to us. Oh, actually, no, I'm reading from their spiel. All right. So the claw is the enemy commander. Um, no one's ever seen him or heard of him, but uh, word is he wants us out of uh, this general area. There's militia uh, activity all over the place. They've got weapons caches. So we're going to send uh, squads two and squads four out to the uh, east and southeast, respectively to patrol sort of said weapons cache and there's also two in this enemy militia who might be moving about. Uh, so specifically Joe's going to be heading down to the tank mark general location. Utopian's going to be positioning over on the uh, helicopter mark, Kilo 7. Trigger's going to be here on uh, on point proper. Uh, he's going to split his forces between here, the main installation and the one that's up on the CTR-80 marker to our northeast. Uh, idea is is to um, try and intercept militia, figure out what angle of attack they're coming from, and kill them all. Um, bear in mind that uh, if your leadership does go down, you'll need to make your way back here. This will be our point of making uh, our last stand. Any questions? All right, awesome. Let's get ready for life. First, um, here you go. Oh, just a little bit. Oh, ND. Oh, hey, 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 hey. that's why you have your shovels out. Y'all keep it down. White guy. I got a uh, EA question. The free weekend, right? The fucking guy. What the fuck? Hey, for fucking yeah, free weekend. It's my first stop, guys. That's right. Oh, it was Frost. Yeah. Yo, Frost. Yeah, I got a question. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Charlie, take, take, or excuse me, take, take. Uh, Viking swapped his kit to a lat. Where can you rearm at? Uh, why respawning? I can look right at you. He respawned on rally, but didn't have it. Can you respawn mine and respawn rally? Yep. Yep, that's it. Make sure to stay on back there. Did you do a boo boo? Maybe. Uh, a boo boo. Frost, pants. no. Oh, that no. you that did that boo boo? Uh, Awesome. Look, it's my first time playing. I don't know what to tell you, man. Left murder hole until I hit with an RPG. I do like the new cami nanny. That's exciting. I know they have towers now for I think it's the insurgents or maybe the militia. It kind of looks like this, but I think it's like this high, and it has that cami netting on it. That you can barely see through. These really armor to hold. Yeah, I like I like the can wait. I'm just gonna test nah it's not gonna be the same. No, nah, not the same. Okay, it's just on that stuff. Looking real on these murder hole type things. Oh, here's one. Yeah. Even in uh these kind of shelters, like you can like you can see all the way through it. But you can't see anything. Going in, I mean, you can barely see, but the further you get away from it, you know, the more blocked out it is. Eat oh, kids. Yeah, I think this will probably be about an hour. Last one was an hour ish. We'll see. I do favor quicker ops. You know, I don't want people sitting in admin cam. They're like one of the first ones to die. Even though, I guess with these smaller, you know, squad size operations, you know, you get a lot of play time. You're not dying as quick. Engagements aren't as fast. Let's see if we can find any militia forces hiding around. I see three down here. I guess this is where I see one over there, far east. Yeah, three's down here, two's there. The so one's starting out here. Let's 
two, three starting here, two starting there, and four is going to start there. Try to get to those cash locations. Just because I'm in admin cam, I can see both sides. Like these marks and five locations and everything is all both sides. It's an admin cam thing. Specialty rule, whatever you want to call it. I know I want to play. I think they, I, I, I think they hid like, like looking at the mortars in in round one, like their impacts just looked different for me. Um, so I don't know. It's weird. Like I don't know. Maybe they adjusted the impact, like, uh, visual effects of them, but it 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 like lit up my entire screen. It was weird. I'm like, oh, this is awesome. And the uh, shock waves were more pronounced and more visible. I haven't changed any of my settings since the last time I uh, was in admin cam. And I'll tell you what, I went to the store today and I'm not, I, I can't, I don't get sponsored by anybody, but I picked up some polar vanilla seltzer water and I picked up like a whole bunch of cans of it and it was earlier today. I've already drank four of them is oh, round two starting. We are live, but yeah, I've, I, I've drank through a, like a quarter of a six pack or, or a 12 pack of them already. Like they're delicious. I am loving this. It's my new favorite drink. It used to be Mio's and just regular water. Everyone's pushing out. Not picking up any of the militia forces close yet. I know they're surrounded by everybody. Command is five. So this is command. Three's down here, two, four, and one. Let's see if we can't see if one's getting close to two. Canadian too. Yeah, they're going the same way as the other ones last round. Let's check in. Ooh. So far. Man's coming across. There's three. Three's going to the other bridge. Two is already at River Farm. I'm looking down at the ground because I'm paying more attention to the map than I am the actual gameplay. Uh, four, the two's across the river. Bit, uh, for some of your travel here. Four's getting close to crossing the river. Copy, copy. We're going to need on the way back. I have actually fought up this oil pipeline before, and it took forever. Your vehicle. Oh, water effects finally showed up. These water effects remind me of like an adult swim, like commercial break. Like, keep watching Squad Ops One Life Events, brought to you by Squad Ops and Wilbur. Hope you're having a great evening. Like it's so soothing. And they're gone. But yeah, going up this was a nightmare. Alright. I'm ignoring those vehicle tire sounds. I think it's a glitch. Yeah, if you can make sure they're oh, they missed uh, radio. I'm watching out to the south. We're gonna sit up on the apartment buildings where everyone's gonna look, Coming and they're gonna stick out like good. sore thumbs. One's probably gonna try to push up through here.
Hopefully Matt takes a right and gets to that cache. I don't know where he's going. The like Alpha's gonna have his people go straight up the pipeline. Get to that cache. Random smoke in the sky. Maybe they're not going to dig down the radius so they don't know that they're there. I'm just going to push in on them, wait for them, set up an ambush. Yeah, in the warehouse. There's command. Don't think. Oh, that's a that's bad. Okay, get back in. Just keep the flow of information going until he gets back, guys. Um, that way we're all updated on what's up. Oh, Astrius is sugar. Jesus. Anyway, I'm like an idiot. About seven oh, meters out from my line. I had to hear his voice. Um, just Sugar's an OG here at uh, Squad Ops. Sugar's the one who got me my uh, seven kills in an operation one time. Guessing that's somewhere in he was the SL or F no FTL. I was an AR set up on a wall, and people were just walking right on by, and he was like, "Get him!" Called in all my shots. Only time I got seven kills in an operation, uh, all because of him. Did you say you have contact, Julia Seven? Correct. Uh, we have contacts in Julia 7 area. My guy's not being super accurate, but he's saying they're going downhill, so take that for what it means. My Bravo lead has eyes on. Three infantry. Seven. What? Oh, oh, two. Yeah, they're all spread along that ridge. They're crossing the road. Adri, you're out. My pot up. Get him. All right, open her. Yeah. All right, adjust to the ridge. 117, tree line. Oh, that works. They're in the road. That's a kill. That's a kill. Yep. A little to the right. A little to the right. Good shooting, Foxtrot. And they are moving from that position southeast. I would imagine the uh, Lima 814, that building somewhere around there. Which one is that? Let's, let's check how the view is over here. I better get set up. Be in the cap. I got enemy, enemies close, 150, 156. Just across the street from my position. We're 
return fire is coming in from approximately uh, Kilo 86. Ooh. And I would say Lima. Somebody just got one tapped? Squad 2 engaging. Um, 100 meters out of one position. Kind of close. Arm orders. Oh, four and two are getting close also. Check out what four is doing. Did, all right, last I saw them, they were moving up over the hill and retreating. Um, roughly Lima 8 3 area. Um, three. Requesting okay. fire mission, three rounds, kilo 8. Nine seven, Kilo eight nine seven, tracking. Fire three. Vocaline's gonna see him. Which way is he looking? Not the right way. Away from Matt Honcho. Is coming toward you from the south. Copy. I'm gonna one tap him. Kilo eight nine two, possible Lima eight four seven. Come on, one of you gotta see him sitting up on top of that log. Oh, okay. Oh, never mind. <laughs> of course, as soon as I look away. Perfect timing every time. Okay. Hey, we just lost we just got our, I just lost one of my guys north west. Northwest of the point. I think Long Darts is going to make it back. All right, be advised, Over we have orders, contacts within 100 meters, or sorry, within 200 meters northwest of the radio. <laughs> We're setting up now. At 2.50 northwest of radio, I'm going to send some orders. Oh, God, I didn't mean to do that. What the fuck? Hey, got them on the, what, west and northwest? They're in the wood piles. Wood piles and rocks in India 6 1. 2, I need you to fall back. 4, I'm trying to. Cover 2. Gearing command, you need to get in there with frost. I cannot, they are getting inside the wire within like one minute. Come this way, Zeppelin. Come this way. Boy, we're falling back now. You should pull your guys out now. Copy, they're falling back right now. is going to catch Matt. Do 
We have guys down there in base. Shug's back in. down at least two is able to make it back cross down too oh liberal's doing some work over there Good toss, Steve -o. Ooh. Contact is downhill from the point. And he's currently jumping over the walls of uh, west and southwest. Efficiency, uh, covering west sector and northwest sector, radio tower. Copy, squad two is. Bush is inside. Bush is inside. Cheese man. The north side. I need to know the distance. Storm. Yep. Uh, you're gonna find him. You're gonna find him in about. Uh, um, you're gonna find him south of the courtyard. Stone south courtyard. I six five eight. I six five eight. Go get up, stand up. Right next to us in this entrance. You are glitching. There you go. Still got five and three down there. Worked their way up. Not looking good for Canada right now. Oh. Got one down. Oh, one right in front of me. Holy crap. Good trade. He's dead. I got the bandage. Good shit. That was a good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Inside the compound. Inside the compound. Copy, copy. No. No. It's like five and three are going to sweep up to the north. Hug a corner. That one's in a nice, dirty little spot. Do not believe so. Squad three is down. Squad three is up. Oh, good job, cheese man. One down on the northeast side. We got Bartok and Blaze Assault in there. Topian. Three, four, this is people. Coming in. Copy. Uh, 
Copy, I got the update on between me and my medic. Still got. Copy. Oh, down goes Blaze. And Bartok. Still got one and three coming up. Definitely ran into each other. Ooh, air burst. They're in a bad place. Puppies goes down. Ando goes down. Gosh. Yeah, you took me. <laughs> nah, shit is right. You are pinched. Down goes butters. It's just utopian and spears. I know it, it, it they still got to reach in and clear everything that's going on in there. Oh, someone just knocked out that. Just be advised if you get inside, the northeast is completely exposed to the hill terrain. Hope he needs to get a move on. too many cameras on the way i can't really give you a good overview of what's happening basically everyone is up for militia is up on the north northeast less than six canadian forces i'm gonna round it out to 12 militia forces Sixteen militia. They're starting to push in now. Smoke's coming in. those murder holes first can't see through them smart idea oh here it comes grenades lats smoke all the good stuff down to three Or four.
They're about to push in from the southwest border. Yeah. The rushing, the rushing. Other IED goes off. Spears gets three. Oh, someone tried to go in for a uh, knife kill and got shot. Took a knife to a gunfight. Now it's down to three. More footsteps. Oh. Oh, no. Was a good defense. Still a good defense. Down to Viking. See if we can hold out. Sweaty palms. Oh no. Oh, don't back yourself into that corner. All right, retreat, Viking. It's another. Oh. Such a good defense. And that is going to be GG for round two, Operation Power Play Part Four. Hopefully, you uh, enjoyed it both rounds, round one and round two on this Friday night, One Life Operation. Uh, yeah. So. Canadian Forces first round were able to complete their mission. And then the second round, Militia was able to complete their mission. Awesome. Great stuff. Love to see it. Quick rounds. That was a lot of fun. I liked watching that. I love Manic. I love it.